If you ever tried running hard gold or soul silver on an emulator, odds are you've encountered some problems with it. But the very first problem that you probably encountered was probably the black screen of death. That occurs right after the Professor Oak speech at the beginning. Now people were scrambling to find a way to bypass that glitch and play the game itself. And they have come up with a solution that I am going to show to you right now. Now the first thing that you're gonna need is both the latest version of NoCash GBA, which we're gonna use to run the game, and we're also gonna need a ROM of Hard Gold and Soul Silver. Now the action replay codes that we're gonna be using for this fix are proper to the the American release. So for all of those of you who are in Europe or Australia, Japan, whatever, make sure you have the American ROM of Hard Gold and Soul Silver. And as usual, just like in my emulation trading tutorial, I am not going to give out links to ROMs or emulators. You're on your own for finding them. So once you got everything, the first thing to do is to open up No Cash GBA and pick your ROM of Hard Gold or Soul Silver. Here it's going to be Soul Silver, and the ROM's actually running quite good, I gotta say. We got an animation of Lugia flying around, and of course you're gonna pick a new game if you want to begin, and you get the exact same thing as in the beginning of every single Pokemon game ever. So, the, the, yeah, this is what's called Twilight. If it's not a hint that the crap is going to hit the fan pretty soon, then I don't know what is. But, all joking aside, um, this part runs rather smoothly, so we're just gonna get to the end of it. And by the way, the, the action replay codes that we're gonna need are going to be in the movie description, so you can do the copy-paste job that I'm about to do just as well. Yes, I'm a boy and not a deliriously fashionably challenged girl, and I'm gonna enter my name as usual, even though it makes no difference whatsoever. Yes, thank you very much. And now that scene is about to end, and now we're going to see the traditional shrinking sequence, and boom! Black screen of death. And we can even hear the new Bark Town music faintly in the background. So now what you want to do is I've got that notepad document ready with the Soul Silver code. What I do is I copy, go back to the emulator, utility, cheats, add new, and then I paste, and then yeah, I'm going to click on Action Replay DS, raw, and I'm going to give it a name. Okay, black screen fix, this should do it. You can do give whatever name you want, and you double click on it, and there we go. Boom! Hard Gold and Soul Silver in all their glorious DS glory. So now that you know how to administer the fix, there are two things that I want you to remember. First, you're going to need to reactivate the code every time you open up Hard Gold or Soul Silver on No Cash GBA. The emulator is going to remember the code, however, you're going to need to recheck the box every time you open the ROM by double clicking on it like I just did. It's a minor inconvenience, I know, but it could be a lot worse. And second, even though these codes fix the black screen of death, there are still a lot of instances where the game may crash. I personally haven't tried it out in depth yet, so I wouldn't know, but for those instances where the game crashes, I can't do anything for you. You're gonna have to look for more complicated solutions than that. And, well, I apologize, but that's how it is. Technology is incredible, but unfortunately, I am not. So in conclusion, now that you can actually start up the damn thing, I hope you are going to enjoy one of the greatest blasts to the past that the gaming industry ever produced. Thank you very much.